Hey, what is up everybody? I'm Starlord, I just got my hair cut and now I'm ready to get back to a few face cam videos. Starting with today's video, unboxing a one-up box and a loot gaming box. It's been quite some time since I've actually done one of these, so yeah, it should be pretty fun. Um, also guys, I would like to say that I have just started a new kind of gaming a series on my channel called Retro Rewind. It's basically where I play old games, one game per episode, and kind of talk about how it made me feel when I was a kid, kind of how I feel about them now, and just like bringing back nostalgic feels, I guess. Enough of that, let's get on with today's unboxing. Starting off with the loot gaming box. Uh, so let's open this up, let's see what we got. First off, we have a Titans. It's a Dragon Age, the hero of Theodas. Kind of looks like Marilyn Manson, actually. And here we go. <laughs> oh, it's a girl. Oh, it's a girl. It's not Marilyn Manson, it's a girl. It's a very creepy looking girl. God, imagine waking up to that in the morning. That looks so, so creepy. Let's see if we can just put that on focus. I'm so sorry, guys. Well, anyway, she looks creepy as hell. You also get some kind of fireball to put in her hand. I, I guess I should take it out, but no, that's that's very fucking creepy. I don't want that in my. I don't even want that in my house. Uh, next thing is the Okami Den. I don't know what that is, but it is from Capcom. Actually, it says Capcom right there. So yeah, something from Capcom is always good. Capcom are an amazing company. Oh, that's so cool. I don't know what it is. I'm guessing it's like an anime thing. Look at that. It's like a wolf. It's like a wolf with this kind of plate, fire plate on its back. With like little tiny wings kind of things. And it has a butthole. It has a butthole right there too. What the hell? That's so cool though. It, it reminds me of something from like Final Fantasy VIII. Next up we do have a Castlevania Lords of Shadow. What is this? It kind of looks like a pencil case. But I know it's not because it's tiny. Holy shit. Holy shit. That's awesome. It has these nice ass kind of, I know you can't see it and I know it's not going to focus in. Uh, let me see if, it, if I cover my face it will. No. Well, anyway, that's got some nice designs on there. That's really, really nice. I may go and stab my girlfriend now. Ah, shit, that's her too. Next up is the pin, which is the mythic pin. And uh, I like that. I like the griffin. Pretty cool. I like it. I always give those to my son. I'm going to put them on his backpack or something like that. I don't know. It's a big, huge griffin with a gr with like a sexy girl next to it. And then lastly, of course, we have awesome t-shirt, which is kind of got like an Assassin's Creed logo. It is. It's an Assassin's Creed black flag top. That's ri th This I like. This kind of color, I would wear this. This is pretty darn cool. Damn, that is nice. I am very impressed with that. They are improving quality as always. And um, of course, we do have the awesome box art. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Woo! Let's get on with the one up box unboxing. And the first thing we have is a cool ass sticker saying you're a wizard. Are you gonna focus in? That is super cute. I can tell my girlfriend will really like that. She loves Harry Potter. Moving on, we do have, I guess it's kind of like a wallet. And it looks like it's from Doctor Who. Yes, it is. But how the frick do we open it? There you go. I, I don't know what I did to your wallet. One up box. But I kind of fucked around with it. And now it's not a wallet anymore. It's a kind of weird cutout. Hello. It smells really bad. I don't exactly know why you would want a wallet that's like paper. <laughs> okay. There you go, okay, I didn't want it anyway, it's all good. Right, next up we have the pin, which is this one right here. One up box, is it gonna focus? Come on, is it gonna focus? No, it's not gonna focus, but it says one up fantasy. It's got the, uh, the little fox or the cat and the panda bear kind of jumping out of the TARDIS. That's pretty cool. Moving on, we do have something very awesome. I love this. It is a Link. Kind of link, I guess. You attach it to your keys, whatever you want. My camera never focuses in. I've got like the most disobedient camera in the world. Well, anyway, it looks fucking cool. I can assure you that right now. It's like he's he's cleaning something. I don't know what he's cleaning, but yeah. We do have a Futurama vinyl dorbs, which is very cool. I love 
that color on um what's his face what's his face what's his name i forget his name zoiper that's it it weren't even on that it, it wasn't even on it i was watching futurama just yesterday too how i forget about fucking zoiberg i do not know there he is right there i always give these to my son he enjoys playing with them and obviously they're very hard to break he's had like an iron man one he's had all sorts now actually and he loves them he really does so i'm gonna give this to my son that is a very nice pink shade though I love that color. Anyway, and then last but not least, guys, we do have the t-shirt, which is very, very cool. It's got Fry in the top right, left-hand side. We have Link in the bottom left. Three-headed dog from Harry Potter. And, of course, Harry Potter himself right there. Do you know what? Like, honestly, I don't really wear the black shirts, I've got to admit. If they're any other color than black, black I wear them. And I have a, a load of these just in my house. Just like kind of there, a size small um, that I know for a fact I'll never wear. So maybe at one point throughout time, I will just do a huge giveaway of Luke Gaming, Luke Crate, one up box shirts. Anyway, guys, that is today's unboxings. I am glad that I've got my hair cut and it kind of looks somewhat respectable now. And I do hope that you guys stayed through the whole video. If you did, then comment because I just kind of like to know who goes through my videos and stays till the very end. It's kind of cool to get to know the people who are really like into the videos. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have an awesome day. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Oh, see ya.